All right. Chaos Legion for the PlayStation 2. So it's been a while since I did an unboxing of a PS2 game. Uh, since it is October now, I figured I'd do something a little more spookier. What the... Savage by nature. So usually when I do unboxings, I'm, I'm pretty familiar with the game and how it plays, but uh, this one, not so much. I have played a small amount of it, but not enough to fully grasp the game, you know, and how it plays. But uh, So this is probably going to be a pretty simple unboxing. But yeah, anyways, let's unbox this. for the top seal. There's the game, and there's the manual. So, let's put that off to the side here. All right. So we got the table of contents. And of course it's in black and white because it's a Capcom manual. Huh. This is interesting. Um, it looks like it's in multiple languages. That's, that's very odd for a, a PS2 manual around this era. I know later on they started doing that, like towards the end of the system's life, but this game's from 2003, so that's interesting. I've never seen that in any other PS2 game before. So we have getting started. Starting up, here's the controls. Here's the story. Uh, the, the story is just like your your typical revenge plot. You know, for, for games like these, which are pure action-based, um, it the story doesn't really matter much to me, but it's, it's nice that it's there, I guess. <laughs> your main menu. Saving your game.
Here is the game screen. And you can see your brief description of what each thing does. Your mission. Player modes. So I guess in this game you have like an, uh, two modes where one is like a, an assault mode where you just play um, as yourself but you're stronger or force mode where you can summon legions which is like summons in this game and then but uh, I guess you're weaker so that's the trade-off. Legions. So again, like the legions are like your these summons that you acquire throughout the game, and then you know you can power them up, make them stronger, and whatnot, and then you can summon them whenever you want, and then they can assist you. So uh, it, it's this game reminds me a lot of. Um, Castlevania Curse of Darkness had a very similar uh, gameplay mechanic where you can like summon some of these monsters to help you and you can make them stronger as well. So I wouldn't be surprised if that game kind of took some inspiration from this game. Uh, intermission. Other screens. So this game goes by like, um, it's like missions basically where you go from room to room and then you kill all the enemies and then you go to the next room and kill all the enemies. So it's very similar to like um, Dynasty Warriors in a way where it's just a mindless hack and slash. And most people compare this game as like a, a mixture of Dynasty Warriors and Devil May Cry, and I could definitely see that. Uh, option mode. That. You have your sound, your screen, brightness. Use the color bar to adjust the TV brightness to a comfortable level. But I, for most, most games have like at least Capcom does. Uh, most Capcom games have like a a color bar to where you're supposed to adjust brightness to where you can't see anything past a certain point. But to me, it always seems like when you do that, the game's too dark. So you're better off just using like a more professional calibration tool if you want to calibrate your TV. You know. And uh, yeah, here's all the different languages now. That's that's interesting. I've never seen that in a PS2 gamer on this era. That's I wonder why they did that. So it looks like it's in Spanish. And then you have your French. Is there anything different though? It doesn't look like it. Mm, nope, not really. Of course, there's your, your advertisement for a strategy guide. And then uh, the old Capcom website. I remember when it used to look like this when you could buy games and stuff on there back then. I think you still can now, but I haven't been to the site in years. <laughs> Pretty short and simple unboxing. But uh, yeah, there you have it. Chaos Legion for PlayStation 2.